Mother of two, Adedoni Bello is in the market in Abuja, Nigeria's capital. She's looking to restock her food pantry and household essentials. But Adedoni's budget is short as prices have risen since her last shopping a month back. She's contemplating what to leave out of her shopping list in order to manage resources. The increment of the things now has actually affected me in so many, many ways for my children. And, you know, at times, the milk they consume in a month, like that, the one they are selling one five now, before it was 1,000 or 1, 2. Now it's 1,500. And in a month, my children used two or three of it. So we are just, you know, we are just trying to manage. Things are not any easier for traders like David Kenneth. The surging food prices have affected patronage. Before a bag of rice is being sold at the rate of 15,000, but now it is 33,000. So the, the price rate is very, very difficult. It's high now to, and the, the customers, like we don't have customers again, and it, it is making um, the sales to be bad. Nigeria's inflation figure rose to 16.82% in April of 2022. That's 0 0.9 points increase from the 15.29% recorded in March. This latest surge has exceeded the International Monetary Fund's projection, which pegged Nigeria's 2022 inflation at 16.1%. Economic watchers say Nigeria's current inflation is not isolated from global inflation, an impact of the Ukraine-Russian crisis. Every other country of the world is experiencing inflation, especially even Western world and very developed economies are experiencing uh, inflation right now. Uh, the obvious reasons are there. The fact that uh, the war between Russia and uh, Ukraine um, has actually um, changed and tumbled all the prices. For us in Nigeria, we were already swimming in inflation before the real cause of inflation came up. You know that in Nigeria, we had our problems uh, of insecurity, which actually did not allow our farmers to go into their farms. Experts projected that the exchange rate crisis also contributed to Nigeria's inflation. Its impact on citizens include dwindling standard of living, growing unemployment rate and low productivity. Among other things, economic watchers say Nigeria would have to boost local production in order to reduce import dependence and gradually reduce inflationary pressures.